going on guys? Today we have a cornhole carrying bag. So, if you guys don't know the game Cornhole, I mean, come on now, um, I bought professional style boards and uh, needed a bag to go with them. Everywhere I looked, they were extremely expensive. And expensive, again, is relative, but expensive going towards a carrying bag. I've seen them as high as 200 bucks, which I think is absolutely ridiculous. I purchased this one on Amazon. This is the Go Sports one and it was 30 bucks so so it comes in three different colors i got the gray version um it has a neutral color which is almost like a beige and then a navy blue one uh just went with the gray today we're going to be opening up this package with a uh, flathead screwdriver of course you know i don't have my nice knife on a day that they taped the entire fucking box. I don't get it, but anyway, we got a little thing card from them. Thank you for your purchase on the back. Has their uh, Instagram and shit on the front. Um, yeah, help donate a bowl to kids in need. If you guys wanna log on there, go for it, why not? So, all right, first impressions. The color sucks. It's definitely not. They did it more of a light gray on uh, the website, but it is what it is. I'm not going to be too, too picky about it. A little dirty, but whatever. Uh, here we go. So, you guys know cornhole boards are four foot by two foot, so it's a pretty substantial size bag. Can't see my fat ass behind it, so that's a good thing. Nobody wants to look at me anyway, right? So, got the logo here. Go Sports logo. It's like a, I want to say almost like um, like a jean material. Um, seems very durable. I gotta give them that. Definitely seems durable. Nice long handles. Um, you got the double stitching on here. Not bad. Here's the uh, zipper, which is a lot of the time the zippers are what goes bad on them. They rip, they get shitty. This one's actually not a bad zipper at all. And that's what you're really paying the extra money for um, for the toughness of the bag which just seems very tough and the actual quality of the zipper so you can open this bag all the way up dual zippers so you could zip it from one end to the other or just put two in the middle whatever you so choose to do and here's the inside of the bag so, once again big bag nothing too crazy like you say you got the handles on it just wanted to do a quick uh, showcase of this product that I purchased. Uh, definitely need a bag. When you're spending three, four hundred dollars for a set of boards, you definitely want to protect them with something. Um, this bag, even though it is thin, it will protect it from scratching. But if you drop it, obviously it's going to uh, dent the boards and all that stuff. So, you know, you might want to consider either getting some type of foam if it will fit in here, or if you're gonna actually get a padded bag. Now, that's the difference between this one for $30 and the $200 one. So you're getting that added padding throughout the entire bag. After purchasing this, what I consider, now I have the knowledge of how this bag is, no, I'm not gonna buy the $200, I'm not gonna buy the $200 one, no. Definitely not. Um, this is gonna serve its purpose. I don't plan on really traveling with them. This is more of a put put the boards in the bag and store them so they're not getting dusty, dirty, and scratched up just from general moving around in like a garage or a shed or something like that. But yeah, so that's basically it. It's a fucking bag. You put shit in it. In this case, a cornhole board. So if you guys like this video, hit the thumbs up down below. Leave a comment if you guys have a bag of some sort, what brand you use, uh, let us know. So that's all I got for you guys today. Thank you guys for watching. We got new videos coming out every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Take care.